Hi there, how are you today? Um, it's been quite a time really, hasn't it? And um, I, can't, I really feel that one of the great loves in my life that I'd love to talk about, good morning, good morning everybody. I'm just seeing your names coming up, which is lovely. Um, one of the things that I would really like to talk about this morning and take you through is the practice of relaxation. And we're going to do a seated relaxation. And um, why is relaxation so important? Well, we know the very um, obvious things that we know about it is that it does help us settle the body, the mind. It helps us to reduce our states of anxiety, concern, stress, etc. And one of the things that I wanted to add to what you already know is that um, whenever we're, we meet a situation which is quite... Um, challenging, which is quite dramatic. So we're in that situation right now with everything, all the changes that we've had to make to our lifestyle. What that demands is a change to our way of thinking. It's a change in our state of being. It has an impact on our emotional resilience, on our mental agility, on our level of perseverance and adaptability. And um, we know that we have to quickly move into the ability to adapt or to adjust to a situation such as this. And relaxation is a really powerful way to be able to enhance those qualities within us. The other thing that it does is that it brings, it helps to um, release hormones in our system that enable us to feel better enable us to feel better about ourselves and therefore enable us to have a more efficient and um, a, a helpful approach to the situation. And that's really what is needed right now is what is it that's going on in our minds? What is it that's really going on in our hearts? How are we feeling? And how can we in some way enable ourselves, our world, our internal world in particular, to feel better? because there isn't a great deal that we can do to change the external situation. So with that, I would really love to take you through a seated relaxation. So wherever you are now, whether you are seated indoors or you may be listening to this again in, in your garden outdoors, if you find yourself in a comfortable position, just place yourself in a comfortable position and I'm seated on a chair and I've actually got um, one knee up here just to give myself that extra little bit of support in my hips, in my pelvic area, so that it can really support my spine. And that's such an important aspect of relaxation. We want that energetic flow to flow freely through the spine at this moment. So we want to keep our spine relatively upright and also relaxed. And then just simply closing your eyes and allow the eyes to just rest and bring yourself into a mental state of rest in this moment now. And draw the awareness down into your feet. And we're not going to move which is what we'd normally do in the first stage of our relaxation in Drew, we're just going to simply take our awareness to the different parts of our body and we'll be using our breath as well. So allow your awareness to come to both feet, to the toes and to the heels, to the soles of the feet, to the top of the feet and the insides of the feet, that lovely space inside. And breathe in and simply focus on that space in your feet and breathe out and just relax. Breathe in and again, take your awareness to your feet and this time into your ankles. And as you breathe out, just allow that space to expand into the ankles and gradually let it travel up into your lower legs and you'll begin to feel that wonderful sense of calm 
of relaxation. Perhaps you'll experience some sensations, perhaps just a cooling or a warmth, or even a tingling in your feet, your ankles, in your lower legs, the calf muscles, the shins. Breathing in up through the feet, ankles, shins, into your knees and up into your thighs. Breathing out and just relaxing into the knees, into the thighs, expanding that sense of space. When you're next ready, breathe in into the hips, that wonderful pelvic girdle and all the muscles and bones contained within that area of your body. Breathe out and simply relax. Allow that space to enter deep within the pelvis and through into the bones, into the muscles. So now you have a wonderful sense of relaxation, of calm, of peace within your legs and within your hips. Breathe into the abdomen and into the lower back, the spine, the vertebrae of the lower back. Breathe out and just let that whole part of your body relax. Softening into the internal organs, breathing in into the chest, through the diaphragm, into that wonderful rib cage, the back, the front, the sides of the chest, the muscles and bones. Breathing out, allowing every part of your chest your lungs, your heart, your rib cage, to feel relaxed. Breathe into your shoulders and down through the arms, right through into the hands and fingers. Enable that sense of spaciousness to expand as you breathe out, relaxing the shoulders and the arms, relaxing the hands and fingers. And breathe in, 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 into your throat, into the neck, right through the whole of the spine to the top and into the head. Relaxing the eyes, relaxing the face, relaxing even every hair on your head. Breathing out, relax. And enable your whole body to feel the sense of relaxation just for another few moments. In this moment now, allowing the wonderful hormones, the happy hormones to fill your body, the endorphins. Allow yourself to feel good in this moment. And then gradually and gently become aware of your physical body, become aware of your muscles and your bones, become aware of your skin and the clothes on your skin. Become aware of your breath and breathe deeply and just begin to move and have a little bit of a stretch, maybe stretch the hands, the arms forward, stretch them up, have a lovely stretch and out to the sides and just twist the body one side and then the other and smile. And I hope you've enjoyed that relaxation. And it's only been really just a, a three or four minute relaxation, but it's incredible how quickly you can get yourself to relax. And please use relaxation as part of your daily practice so that you can increase the adaptability to this amazing situation that we find ourselves in. Thank you so much. I hope you've enjoyed it all. Oh, and just to remind you that tomorrow evening we have our Friday Night Live with our wonderful panel of health experts. We've got um, Dr. Janie Fitzgerald, who's been a GP of 30 years. We've got Annie Jones, who is an expert in Ayurveda, and it's being hosted by Nana Coppins. 
please join them. They will be answering your questions. If you have any questions or concerns, particularly about the current situation, whether it's to do with um, physical health, mental health, emotional health, any aspect, maybe food, maybe nutrition, exercise, any questions, please could you send them in? You can pop them into Instagram or Facebook at the moment and we will let you know um, uh, if there's a platform that, that um, we're hoping to create, we'll let you know when that's up for you to send your questions in into the Together at Home website. So join us tomorrow, um, Friday Night Live tomorrow evening, and we'll see you then. Take care.